uh, we have assured the people of Copper Belt and Dollar in particular that we are going to work very hard to apprehend and to arrest and to bring to book all those criminals that have been involved in blowing Her statements are rarely and... short of warnings against yeah, people involved in unlawful activities. Yeah. Copper Belt Police Commissioner Mary Tembo is synonymous with such pronouncements. Copper Belt will never go to sleep. We are working 24 hours around the clock. We will get hold of them. The best thing they can do is for them to refrain from whatever they are doing. We are not here to play. We have been warning these anti boss to say we will never compromise. We are not going to compromise at the expense of the government. But allegations of professional impropriety have emerged against the Copper Belt Top Corp. This follows alleged donation of a vehicle by a local mining company for her operational purposes. The divisional police chief is alleged to have received a Toyota Corolla registration AAX5716 from Grizzly Mining Limited, a keto based company. According to correspondence dated 23rd May 2013 obtained by Movie TV News, the company's human resource manager, Devi Piri, indicates that the respective motor vehicle valued at 15,000 kwacha is meant to ease Ms. Tembo's transport challenges. However, this is contrary to Chapter 10 of the Penal Code of the Laws of Zambia that prohibits any person in a public office from obtaining property or other benefits in such a manner. But in a telephone interview with Movie TV News, Ms. Tembo claims the motor vehicle donation was a police operation aimed at tracking officers who have allegedly been involved in criminal activities on the cop belt. Now we have known the officers that have been stealing documents from the police, passing them either to Jarabo information or over anything that we want to do you find that the criminals will be aware that we are going to, to carry out an operation. So we said, but how long are we going to go on with this thing? So we set a trap. So now we have known the officers that have been either dealing with criminals or giving information to the press. Meanwhile, an inquiry by Movie TV News at Road Transport and Safety Agency reveals change of ownership of the same Toyota Corolla from Grizzly Mining Limited to Miss Mary Tembo's name of House Number no. 3, Bukufa Road, Town Center, and Dollar has already materialized. And the commissioner admits to that fact. When we were doing this trap, we wanted to complete all the procedures. Because if we cleared with the police, the, the officers would have suspected to say there's something that we want to do. I registered everything. Yes. I don't even have the vehicle. In that case, it now remains to be seen how the police command will deal with erring officers. Mwaka Nam Fukwe, Movie TV News.